Summer's blistering heat can be hard to beat, but drinking plenty of water is a must to prevent dehydration and other problems. Here's a breakdown of how much water you really need. Summer heat can feel relentless. It can quickly take its toll on our body. Consumer Reports says keeping properly hydrated is critically important. Dehydration can increase your risk of dangerous heat stroke and chronic dehydration can accelerate the aging process. So is following the old age tenet of drinking eight glasses of water a day the way to go? Keeping properly hydrated doesn't mean measuring and downing water all day long. Everybody is different and everybody has different fluid needs. What's the best way to stay hydrated? CR says the good news is it doesn't have to be all water all the time. Seltzer, milk, fruit juice, even coffee and tea are great ways of getting fluids into your body. But CR says stay away from sugary drinks like soda. They're full of empty calories. What about drinks and powders that claim to be ultra hydrating? They often contain electrolytes, so they may be beneficial for athletes who sweat a lot. But they often also have sugar and artificial flavors. So for average exercisers, water is plenty. Another great source of fluids that might surprise you, foods. CR says nearly everything we eat has some water in it. Look for fruits and vegetables because there, the go-to source is the best water replacer. Some good options are watermelon, where one small wedge contains seven ounces of water. Eat a large peach and get about five ounces. A cup of cucumbers, that's four ounces. CR says it's critical to pay attention to your body. Watch for symptoms of fatigue, wooziness, headaches, and cramps. If you or someone else is suffering from heat stroke, call 911 immediately, get into an air-conditioned room, and don't drink anything. And if you exercise, Consumer Reports says it might be a good idea to weigh yourself before and after your workout and drink 16 to 24 ounces of fluid for every pound you've lost after your exercise.